Hey everybody, I'm Kyle Guerin. I'm the executive director of the PDS Foundation. Today we've got uh, Taylor Studebaker, a team member at the PDS Foundation, and we are honored to have one of our recent recipients of the Carolyn Gazal Dental Assistance Scholarship, Ryan Doyle. Ryan, thanks so much for being here with us today. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. So Ryan, uh, why don't you just tell us a little bit about yourself? So I am a uh, United States Marine Corps veteran. I served uh, from 2014 to 2018. Um, my whole Marine Corps experience has to do with the leadership that I received when I was in, which is why I'm always really big on leadership. Yeah, yeah, that's that. I remember, you know, when we were talking through your interview for the scholarship, that was clear, very clear and evident. So I focus on the things that are important to me. I don't need other people's gratification, I don't need people's approval. And that's something that Master Gunner Sergeant Gustafson taught me. My dad also taught me that as well is that you know, it doesn't matter what I think, it doesn't matter what Jimmy down the street thinks, it doesn't matter what anybody thinks it's what you think is right yeah that's awesome I think in your interview we could really tell that you're really passionate about the industry and really had a heart for service can you like tell us just a little bit more about you know why you chose dental assisting and as I know you talked about like just really wanting to keep serving your community so generally that was like the main uh, the main reason why is because I can serve my community again. Um, something a little bit more technical. It's very challenging, actually. I uh, doing like Corona polishings, and we're doing sealants right now. Um, it's tough. There, there's there, now. I'm not saying like the thing itself is tough, but being able to. There's so many steps, and I. It, that's the kind of stuff that you know drives me wild. I love that kind of stuff because I like the challenge. I like the fact that I'm having to think about this as I'm doing it. So that's like the big thing about the whole dental industry, because I'm not going to just stop at DA. I'm going to get my RDA right away. I'm going to go take my test. You know, after I'm an RDA for a little while, I'm going to go back to school, maybe become a hygienist. When I become a hygienist and I decide that, you know, this, you know, I need, I need more challenge in my life. I'm going to go back to college. I'm going to try to get a PhD. I'm going to try to go and fulfill that, that really, that last final dream that I have is becoming a maxillofacial surgeon. That's what I want to do. That's my long-term goal. Like may, maybe 10, 15 years from now. 